As I was exploring through the uh, schemas, I noticed something. The architectural Revit model had structural framing, and when I look at the structural, it also has structural framing. If I want to get the information from both uh, sources, what I can do is select the structural framing in one and then search all data sources and add to the list. Now when I say import from list, it will bring in all of the structural framings from all of the sources in this I model. Notice now I have a structural framing here and a structural framing well, I should have more than one structural framing. Ah, I have two structural framings. The A5 and A8 structural framings will tell you where the file came from. If you come back and look at the A0 level of the tables, you'll notice that they're listed, each of the sources. So if I look at A5, that's going to be the architectural and A8 is going to be the structural. So that way I can keep straight which ones I have and where they came from. The other thing that is in this file is where the I model is stored. So if you ever uh, move the I model you can also uh, change this path and keep your data consistent.